Hey YouTube, Mr. Clue here with a quick puzzle guide for my 1k views. So as soon as you pull it up, you're going to have something like this right here. Okay, the first thing to your strategy that I'm going to show you guys is to get the top four aligned. From left to right, not right to left because it won't really work. At least I haven't tried it. So I'm going to uh, speed it up through this part real quick. And if you don't know how the picture looks like, I'll probably have a link in the bottom. So once you get the top four... You're going to want to have the fifth piece under its original position. So as you guys can see to the right. And you guys are going to move it all over, bring it up, and then move it all down. Move that one opposite piece down. So once you do that, bring all the other pieces back. And you're going to have the top row. So after that, for the next two rows, you guys are going to do the same thing. So uh, I'm going to speed it up real quick. You guys can see how it's done. So... There's the top one and move it all over, bring it up, and there you go. And for the last row, kind of, it doesn't really matter what you do with the bottom pieces, just don't get the, the rows, the top three rows, like out of place. So once you have that, this is where it changes. You're going to want your left corner, bottom left corner, the four, you don't want them to be aligned. So what I do is I get them to follow each other, kind of like the bottom one to the top one. So you guys will see like right about here. See how I got the bottom piece and the top piece right there? You're going to want to do the same thing with the next one as I just did. And that's going to line up into place. And then pretty much for the rest, it's you just spin them around as you guys will see. Get the top one, follow it. And yeah. And once you get those, everything else just falls into place exactly. And ta-da, you're done. So once you get it, just go talk to your person, and there you go. It's complete. All right, guys, thanks for watching, and uh, thanks very much for the 1K views of my other guide. I hope this helps people that don't really understand puzzles, and I'll see you guys next time.